NFDC's job has always been that of a facilitator to help in production, distribution, exhibition, also in terms of export of Indian films, etc., etc. So if they have take, created a kind of single window permission area, then there's nothing like it. I think I've, it's, uh, congratulations are in order. I'm, I have always been of the opinion that, you know, there is no reason why we should make it difficult for people who come from outside of our country to shoot within the country, within our country. You see, there are designated areas that have high security zones. Every country has them. So you, 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 they are out of bounds. And that's out. Once that is out, why should people not be able to do their work peacefully, you know, according to the way they want to? And if that happens, it would be absolutely wonderful because India is a great country for, for not only for Indians to shoot in, but even for people who come from outside. I, I hope it will continue to do so, continue to be so. I hope they will be able to expand they're functioning and I hope that the Film Bazaar will lead to NFDC dealing individually with as many countries as possible outside of India. Because if that happens, then they, they can in fact parallel, if not uh, you know, equal, at least come close to what the MPAA, you know, MPEAA, that is the American uh, film industry, the way they they have worked out the export of their films. With the Film Bazaar, well, I haven't had very much to do with the Film Bazaar, but uh, I can see that uh, when it comes to the uh, festival itself, uh, their activities are very useful activities. I think in that sort of uh, sense, the Srin Bazaar has been extremely useful and it's, a, it's, a, it's something that needs to be extended and deepened. Mm -hmm.